Hi, welcome to TechEye. Today we're going to talk about the core and thread in CPU. So without further ado, let's go! Cores in a CPU is an individual processing unit within the CPU. Traditionally, CPUs had a single core, but modern CPUs can have multiple cores, each capable of executing instructions independently. To further understand, the core is the one doing the task. Normally, each core can carry one task. So the more core you have, the more multitask CPU can be. The speed in multitasking in the CPU also depends on the core. So the more the core the CPU has, the better and the fastest the execution will be. Like parallel processing, multiple cores allow a CPU to perform multiple tasks simultaneously. For example, a quad-core CPU can handle four separate processes at once. Example. It can run four separate tasks at the same time, such as web browsing, playing music, running a game, and performing a background update without significant slowdowns. This can also improve performance. By dividing tasks among multiple cores, a CPU can process more data more quickly, improving overall performance, especially in multitasking environments and applications designed to utilize multiple cores. Now, to make the work faster and simultaneously, here comes the thread! A thread, in CPU terminology, is the smallest sequence of programmed instructions that the CPU can manage independently. Each core can handle multiple threads, depending on whether the CPU supports a technology called Simultaneous Multi-Threading (SMT) or Hyper-Threading, a specific implementation by Intel. Thread is like an extra arm for the core. With this extra extra help, core can now do the task more faster. And how does it work? Threads allow a CPU to manage and execute multiple sequences of instructions concurrently. Each core can switch between threads quickly, providing the illusion that it is performing multiple tasks simultaneously. Increased Efficiency With technologies like hyper-threading, a single core can handle two threads at once. This improves efficiency and utilization of the CPU's resources, as it can better manage idle times and perform more operations in the same period. Example, a CPU with hyper-threading might have four cores and eight threads. This means each core can manage two threads, effectively doubling the number of tasks the CPU can handle at the same time compared to a non-hyper-threaded CPU with the same number of cores. With more cores and threads, a CPU can handle more applications running simultaneously without performance degradation. For instance, you can run a web browser, a video editor, a game, and background processes all at once, with each core and thread managing different parts of these tasks. All in all, Cores, individual processing units within the CPU that can execute tasks independently. Threads, subdivisions of processes that cores manage, they represent the smallest unit of processing tasks. More cores threads, generally lead to better multitasking and performance in multi-threaded applications. Understanding the balance between cores and threads is crucial when choosing a CPU based on your specific computing needs, whether for gaming, professional workloads, or everyday tasks. Please leave a comment below, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more TechEye information. Ciao!